Well, my name is Dustin Miller. I'm from around these parts. And, well, I'm going to explain to you my phobia. I got crackdophobia. That's what the doctors call it, at least. I just call it complete nonsense. Basically, it's I got it when I was about six years old. And I was playing on a playground one day, you know. Me and my best friend Bubba, we like to play in the playground. Like every grade school plays in the playground. And, you know, we're playing around. And Bubba tells me, what, you know, you probably heard this before. Don't step on a crack or you break your mama's back. Well, I didn't listen to Bubba that day. Ugh, you know what happens when you don't listen to something. You just blow it off like it's no big deal. Like it's something... You never, you never paid attention to it before, and you know it was it happened to be a serious deal. Well, that day I played hopscotch. You know, kids that like to play hopscotch, and I stepped on a crack. Well, you know what happened? Something very serious happened to me that day. She done fell off a ladder. I couldn't do one thing right in my life. <laughs> And I darn stepped in a crack and my mama broke her back. And ever since then, I just can't, I can't get over the fact that I put my mama in a hospital. It's so stupid. <clears throat> One day I came home after being made fun of from my crackophobia. All day hassled. I came home in a fit of rage and something came over me. <laughs> <laughs> The flipping TV, I threw it out on the balcony. Huh. And I think I jumped off the balcony, maybe beat it with a hammer. And Maybe I threw weight on it. Maybe I cried a little, but it was all I might have wet myself too, but I think um yeah, I don't know what happened. Just something came over me in that day. Complete anger and rage. I must have liked that, I don't really remember. I walked to school, one place, direct shot, there a dang cracks, you know, bricks, cracks everywhere, they just lay the bricks down, and I can't even use the path. What are they thinking? So I go around, I get the classes. Some classes, they they have cracks all over the place. They use that darn linoleum tile. And you know what's worst of all is going to the bathroom. Them darn bathrooms, they don't have cracks everywhere. Uh, Dustin Miller is about a third cousin of mine. Uh, he always says he's like my best friend or whatever, but uh, totally not true. He's, he's kind of a weird, squirrely guy. Anyway, he's kind of down on his luck. <clears throat> told, him I'd, told him I'd give him a job. He was, he was hard up for some cash, helping his mom out and whatnot. But he uh, starts working for my company. And uh, I run a, run a small uh, construction company about an uh, hour north of here. Do a lot of concrete work and uh, pick them up for the first day. And uh, all I have to do is put stress cracks in this concrete. We're just doing, doing some facial work. Hey, uh, you got any uh, beer back there, dude? You got no beer? Yeah. Name's and, Ginger. Uh, all right, you said it already, dude. And uh, uh, so, anyway, start, start giving him a trowel, have him start doing some flat work. And uh, he's a. Uh, do this concrete finishing for me. I let him go with the other guys.
And you know what? I didn't do half bad, I didn't think. I got in trouble every now and then. You know, I'd like to... <laughs> they asked me to pour concrete. I'm afraid of cracks. What are they thinking? I didn't pour the cracks in there. They darn got mad at me. My manager yelled at me. Why are you not putting cracks in the concrete? I looked up at him. I'm afraid of cracks. Moran? I was like, this is not going to work out. I was like, you're just not cut out for this type of work. I mean, with your whole phobia thing, it's just not It's just not in the cards. You know, so I kind of broke it to him. I felt bad. He was, he was a family member and whatnot. But. So, they, you know, they fired me. Of course they fired me. Some people just don't have any understanding for people that are different. You know. I try to have sympathy, but by God, I fired. Here I am, lounging around, trying to get stuff done. Simple life. Well, I reckon I'll never get over my fear of cracks, or my phobia. It's just something I guess I'll have to learn to live with, what I've been doing. This was hard.